Norwich Free Academy won its first three football games of this season by a combined 85 points. But to become a first place team, the Wildcats have had to win two physical games in the past two weeks. They went into Bill Mignault Field on Friday night and defeated Ledyard 13 to 12. The game was scoreless into the second quarter until Ledyard quarterback J.J. Jablonski hit Sam Sacamano for 23 yards setting up Jablonski's one-yard touchdown run on fourth and goal. Kicker Nate Conway missed the extra point, however, one of the plays in the game that loomed very large at the end. NFA responded quickly. Quarterback Gabe Homsky hit Alexis Camacho for 21 yards, and Camacho scored from eight yards out with 3.16 left in the second quarter to tie the game at six. NFA kicker Steve Kalitri also missed the extra point, and it was tied at six at halftime. It was cold tonight. I had thermals on, and I had uh, wind pants on the sideline. Does that um, make it tough to kick? The ball is a little hard, and my leg's a little stiff. To the third quarter we go when Jablonski picked off a Homsky pass that gave the Colonels a first down at midfield. Two plays later, Zeke Torres went 33 yards, setting up Chris Blomstedt's nine-yard touchdown run, and it was 12 to six. Again, Conway missed the extra point. On NFA's next possession, the Wildcats went 60 yards, culminating with Homsky's three-yard run, and Kalitri made the all-important extra point to make it 13-12. I just had to clean out my head and believe my team, and they're always going to be there for me, so I just had to put it through the uprights. Ledger took over with 9.06 left and went from its 20 to the NFA 20, but on fourth and five, Scott Tarbox picks off Jablonski's tipped pass, and NFA assumes sole possession of first place in the ECC with the 13-12 win. Oh, I just looked up and I saw it. I just grabbed it. I knew, I knew we were holding it and winning that game. If we really want to continue to move on, okay, and, you know, and, and play the teams that we're going to be playing on our schedule, we've got to be able to play a physical game of football. This game right here made us stronger. It was a defensive battle. It's, it's disheartening because, uh, you know, we had some chances. Um, you know, but in a game like this, it's, the little things are, are of magnitude. <laughs> Like, and, uh, like point at like PATs. And, 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 and you know, you, you tell the kids from day one, big games are going to come down to the conversions. That's what high school football is. It comes down to the conversions. And the fact that we didn't convert and they did, you know, that, that's a big part of it.